Yellow. Speaker, chicken neck. Who? Chicken neck. Nobody by that name here. What about chicken balls? Nope. What about chicken fucking gizzard? Hey, people, welcome to Bethel Brothers Hot Rod. Today I'm going to be working on tank, and uh, Joe's going to go into Sacramento, so he's trying to yank his tire off the Ukon. Stick around. As he pumps the jack into the air. Rawr. 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 Yeah. Get some. Yeah. Mr. Joe's tires. Seen some wear here on the side, and at one point, the threads are showing. See, Joe's got this weak spot going, and you can see the. Get out of the way, man. I gotta get this done treads and junk. He's got to go get the tire down in Sacramento because they don't have 20 inch tires up here in the woods. We got RV tires. Yeah. <laughs> Tractor tires maybe. Put some RV tires on it. And they won a gazillion dollars for them but down in Sacramento they're pretty common with all the thug life. Right G money? Yeah yeah yeah. I'm gonna work on tank. You're still gonna sell this, right? Yeah. This is just not what Joe needs for right now. So I'm gonna do all the work on this and paint it up. And it's gonna go on the for sale block. The chrome's still in good shape. The hood, I'm just like freaking out over. But all this chrome right here is gonna get redone. It'll look pretty cool. A lot cleaner than this so I'm gonna get to work on it I have a few things I want to do and a few things I can do and so blah 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 I know a lot of shows have been saying hey use Ziploc bags to hold your bolts and stuff I know this was one of the first shows to do it so it's a good way to keep track of your stuff you can label it, you know exactly what project it's for, so utilize it. I got the hood off, it's going to be easier to work with. And I'm going to stow the bolts so I can find them easier. I got a bunch of stuff I'm going to be taking off of this. Joey doesn't know so don't tell him. I'm going to take the bumper off, the grill off, the lights off, the blinkers off, uh, the tail lights. This is going to be one of the fastest projects I do. so. For you guys that want to know stuff about paint and restoring chrome and all that other junk, I suggest you pay attention to these episodes. Got the hood all sanded down here and hung. Had to prop it up with the ladder because it's so heavy. I got a couple little spatter marks that I got to go over with some sandpaper, but then I'm going to shoot it with some of that oil-based paint to help fight off all the rust and all that other great junk that it was on there. Probably throw on a big texture thing so I can sand it. And if there's enough paint, I'll shoot the backside kind of running low on materials so I'm gonna see what I can do but I just wanted to show you the primer stage you like that Well, that's trying, man. I'm gonna work on this cancer pit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Can't you wait? Oh, I know you can't because that's how you are. You're a bunch of sickos. So I'm gonna grind this out. This is just like a before. So you can get a look at how nasty it was. There's even like some junk growing in here, man. Look, there's like some moss growing. <laughs> oh, dude. There's some more growing right there. <laughs> Is a mossy truck. 
I'm gonna fill all these corners with some silicone when I'm done. I gotta grind it out. That's a lot. And no, I'm not gonna do Lord of the Dance in the back. That'd just be weird. So, there you go. Be back. Got a little update for you people. Grinded the tailgate, most of bed. Here, check it out. Before. After. Before. After. Got the wheel wells. I still gotta get the side of the bed, the back, and this portion. And then uh, get these little edges up on the top. It'll be almost ready to paint, so I'm ahead of schedule. I'm gonna take a little break. Sun's out, it's pretty warm. The metal's getting like an oven, dude. Okay, people, you saw me and Joe putting the hood on. Uh, I've taken off most of the, the grill and the chrome stuff, which I've already polished, but I'll show you that later. Hood's got a coat of paint on it. Did a lot of sanding down the sides. Tons of sanding in the bed. Taking off stuff. Man, it's a huge job. But it should be painted within three days. Done. Done, done. Done, stamp, done. Polished chrome. The works. But I'm starting to lose light. Well, people, that's going to do it for today's episode. Hope you learned something. Thanks for tuning in and watching Bethel Brothers Hot Rod. Remember, use American labor. Keep America working. Build that economy, babies.